I'm 2,000 kilometers away from the nearest ocean, but here in the small county in the mountains of Xinjiang called Nilaku, there's an ocean of a different kind. An ocean of solar panels, 5.7 million of them. The size of this project is unfathomable. There are solar panels as far as the eye can see and then some covering an area as big as the city of Paris. They're stretching to the hills behind me and the hills behind them and the hills behind them all the way to the horizon. The farm is capable upon completion of generating 8 billion kilowatt hours of electricity each year. That's enough to power all the houses in Singapore for an entire 12 months using nothing but sunlight and wind. But this isn't just about energy because these panels slow down the wind. And mind you, the wind here can be super strong. I mean, just look at the crazy hair. To hold in moisture and help grass grow back. Mr. Cricket, can I have an interview with you? I think I need to speak to his PR people. For the people here, it also means extra income, 280,000 US dollars according to estimates. Nearby farmers have worked on the construction of this industrial farm, are leasing their land to the project, and continue to raise animals under the panels. It's a model that allows the land to produce both power and pasture. I tell you, these sheep are very pricey. I've been following them the entirety of the morning, but they're just not cooperating and they don't want to be on camera, so they're always running away. But come back, come back. <laughs> China's Green Push has seen it become the world's biggest supplier and installer of clean energy technology. 74% of all solar and wind projects under construction right now are in China. And within China, Xinjiang leads the way with the largest operational solar farms because of its wide open spaces and long daylight hours. It's energy, ecology, and economy all in one place. And it's one of these inspiring stories about Xinjiang that don't get much attention outside of China. But really, the progress here is as bright as the sun shining above me.